In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can add captions to your photos and display them in the slideshow module so that they export in your slideshow PDF. So right now I'm in the library module and I'm going to select the photo that I want to add a caption to. And then on the right hand side, you can see that there's a metadata panel. You want to scroll down and under caption, you can type whatever you like. And you can see that I have also added captions to these other photos. So if I click on it, on this top photo, a new caption appears. In this photo, I wrote a more lengthy caption explaining the adjustments I made to the photo. So once I've added the captions to all the photos I'd like to have in the slideshow, I will select those photos and then go to the slideshow module. And you can see that the caption is appearing right here and kind of not quite in the middle, but not exactly in the place I'd like it to be. So first I'm just gonna go through some of the options. Don't check zoom to fill frame because what that does is it'll expand whatever image is here to fill the screen and that usually means it's going to cut something off. So just leave that unchecked. And then if you're not seeing your caption here right away, it's probably because under overlays you don't have text overlays checked. So if I uncheck this, you can see that it disappears. The other thing is um, down here in the film strip it's showing me the four photos that I have selected and so under use you can say selected photos or if I wanted all of the film strip photos I would select that and all of the film strip photos would get exported into my PDF. And then here in the ABC if for some reason your, let me zoom out a little bit, if for some reason your text isn't showing here in addition to text overlays or you want to add more text, you can go to ABC and pick from the drop down menu what you would like to show. So right now this one is showing the caption but perhaps you would want to show the date and then you can see that it's appeared right here. I'm going to delete that one for now. So I'm going to position my caption where I would like it to be. And you'll notice that when I preview the slideshow using these arrows, the caption position is the same on each page. Now in this um, image, the caption is so long you can't see it. And you can resize the edge of the caption by doing this, but sometimes the text will get so small that you can't even read it. So the way to create two lines for a caption is actually to go back to the develop module where you actually originally entered your caption. So let's see, oh, I have to just select this one. So where I say I increase the saturation I'm going to make a few lines and you have to hold down control on your keyboard and then hit return or enter and that'll make a new line. So now let's take a look at it. Now you can see that it has actually put it on three different lines so that we can see it all. And obviously it's hard to see what this text is saying. So you want to select the text first and that will allow these options to be visible. And then you can select a color um, something that's kind of easy to read. It's a little bit hard for me to find something that will work with that colored background, but for now I'll pick this color 
and you can see that it changed it here. Um, once you find a color that works for you, you will just go to export PDF. It'll ask you to enter a title and where to save it and you'll hit export and that should do it.